Hello and welcome back to the evil lair of Amunjero, where it's all evil and there are devils and demons everywhere. We gotta kind of work with them to get things going. So that's fun. So the let's see. Shadows can't be unbeatable. There must be some way I can reach him or my friends. The one who commands us does not entertain guests, and his control of this place surpasses yours. I doubt he knows an insignificant speck such as you is even here. Then I'll get his attention. Somehow. Oh, you could try. But I am certain his energies will soon be consumed with murdering your friends. Yeah, and so after they are that, playing on her fears no and guilt to make her do foolish his things. As an afterthought. A shame. I've rather enjoyed our brief time together. Bloody he's not devils. Stopping them and he's not going to get me. And your plan? I'll think of something. Spoken as if time would wait for you. It will not. But you will realize that soon enough. Bloody devils. Just keeping her Oh, okay, so we're not just she's not just constantly like a room away. You, you, you got it. You can't, uh, you, Fred's access can't guess how you got in here. Oh, by the god, it's this idiot again. Oh, no, you speak of Zexus, did we? Zexus will smear you into bloody face with his hands. He will tear you. Look, it's amusing, this whole Zexus this, Zexus that thing. thing. That's not the proper way you should talk to people. I mean, by the gods, are you some kind of dimwit? Yes. <laughs> Referring to yourself when you speak, it's a sign that you're really losing it. Doing great, Nishka, Nishka but maybe let me handle this, alright? Yeah, hear that? He didn't use his name once when he talked to me. You just wait! The master will come and crush you! Then give your remains to Zaxis to feast upon! You let your master carry out all your threats? You were Zaxis not trapped here! Zaxis soon be tasting traps of your flesh in the bowels of the abyss! Unlikely. However, you will help me by opening the door to the laboratory for me. I don't think there's the way to uh, get to uh, get this, but uh, sure. What? You want Zexus to help you? Why in the streaming hells would Zexus ever help you? If you help me, I'll put a good word, uh, word about you uh, to your master, right before I kill him. The master will destroy you when he arrives! He will let you run! He will let you run, but when he grows bored of you, he will crush you beneath his heel! But Zexus doesn't want to wait for the master! Ah, we get a little bit of a fight, have fun. How's this fight going? It actually don't I don't think it's going that well. I'm not good at making friends with demons, it seems. Hmm. And he has like weird swirly particle thingies. On the one hand, and we are, he's not really hurting us, but we're not hurting him either. I think it's time to engage divine might. There we go, let's do this. Oh, well. Oh, and just suddenly an iron golem appears. Iron golems out of nowhere! 
Robots out of nowhere! It's always robots out of nowhere. You never expect the uh, robot apocalypse. How are we actually doing on ammo, by the way? I think we're going through it fast. We might need to switch out to a melee weapon. Yeah, I think it might be time to switch to a melee weapon instead. So let's get our rapier out. We have an unidentified short sword. Let's actually look listening. what this is. Wow, this must be a powerful short sword if Elodie can tell me what it is. What about if I like buff her stuff up? The Night Thief's Claw. 2-6 gets bonus. I mean this is good, but really anyone that's too weapon fighting should already have those feats, so it's kind of a useless thing. It'll probably get sold, but it is like a nice lightning damage, so. Oh, and we have a belt that we don't yes. know about. Because of belt of strength and warding, that is, I believe is very good. Yeah, it does strength for neutral characters. Okay. Hmm. Yes. What are you wearing? Yes. I am listening. We're gonna hang on to this one. I think uh, I mean, I could give it to Alani. It might not be a bad idea for Alani. A bit more strength and everything. And uh, it means we can drop the ring of protection because it's the same kind of this one and put this ring in. I just have to give this belt of guiding light to someone else and you pretty much don't have anything yet, so. Oh, and apparently this thing. Very good. I would say yes. And I still did not switch to a melee weapon yet. Let's change that one. I should have my rapier somewhere about here. Ah, here it is. The Mercy Killer Blade. Now, given the actual knowledge of the Mercy Killers, which is like a super lawful uh, uh, organization that like kills without mercy, kills the wicked without mercy, mercy is a shield, we use it on the weak, that sort of thing. Very much leaning towards lawful evil. Honestly, it doesn't fit uh, for Denzen to use, but you know, its powers are useful. Zex's minions are beaten, and Zexus will waste no more time on you! Tell me the name of your master. Zexus doesn't do what you tell him, little crunchy meatling. Zexus will keep his knowledge to himself and what you see in silence! Yeah, Zaxxus is a dick. Hello there, what more sexy so devils, demons, things. Succubuses, yeah. Are you a present from our master? He is not in the habit of granting gifts. He will not listen to me. Is there any way to reach your master? No, not for you. And what would you say if you could? Tell him to surrender. Let my friends alone. You are here with friends? Oh, you might have a better chance of getting them to listen than our master. Is there a way to speak to them? My, you have strong feelings for them indeed. Go on, that should be enough. Simply think of them. Perhaps you can speak to them, but I do not know how long the connection will hold. Oh, and don't teleport around. It will ruin your concentration. Can you hear me? Okay, that's interesting. Shall we go? This place is sealed by demons and devils. No shit. But listen, they say that their lord is unbeatable. Stay where you are. We're going to try and get to you. I don't think we can get to each other yet. I've tried. This place is difficult to figure out. So far, it isn't. Be careful. I don't think they were lying about this. Killing our master? Oh, it's not impossible. What? I... Humans are so easily distracted. Now I'll have to wait. Yeah, very convenient teleporting. Okay, so there was like an iron golem stomping out of this room. This is... Is! 
off the beaten path. Thank you, Nishka. That was just in time. Uh, yeah, no, no, don't go there. Okay, everyone, move away. We're gonna get that little prick to uh, ch change uh, charge after us, rather than us in the trap. Nishka, unless you're going to disable that trap. Yeah, just kill the thing before and then disable the trap. Excellent! Wow, okay. Well, it was a natural one that we rolled. There we go. Uh, I'll leave this to Denzel to pick up. I like to keep the loot all in one inventory if I can. A bastard sword. Shame no one uses that. Warhammer! Someone definitely does use that. A full plate armor. A helmet. This is some good loot. Uh, at least I hope so. It's a lot of unidentified. But, um, actually, it's more loot than we can handle. Wookie! Okay. I'm gonna have to go through inventory sorting again. Identify first, and I'll just throw some stuff onto Nishka. See how much you can carry. Scrolls we can put with her. These we can stack, there we go. There. That should have made uh, enough space. Right, let's tell us what this stuff is. The nameless light. Damn, that's actually quite good. It's a uh, anti evil sword. Can we use bastard sword? I don't think I so. Yes. Nope, unfortunate. Else I would definitely be wielding that. Okay, what else do we got? I am listening. Hammer of the Wisp. That's not that great. That'll get sold, I'm pretty sure. Rainbow armor! Magnificent! Oh, but only like a bandit plate. That is not that good, so that'll end up setting sold as well. Okay. I would say yes. Ow. Okay, they like the traps here. And that imp is not hostile. Deal with the trap first and then have a little chat with that imp. The imp appears transfixed to be frozen in midair. Eyes transfixed longly on the bookcase in front of it. Does not respond to your presence. Okay, uh, an ancient book. And a bit about potions. We don't really need the potion uh, recipes. So what's this ancient book uh, here? Okay, let's see what that actually does. It has a couple of activations on it. Apparently can be used on people. Okay. The book contains a list of phrases and languages you don't recognize. Seven pages appear detachable. Perhaps for use of scrolls. Yeah, let's study the phrase, see what they mean. Okay, we can't. 
Close the book. Can we try something again? Spellcraft! We are good with that, so let's try. Okay, well, then we definitely are not going to use the book. I'm surprised. Do we not have good spellcraft? I thought we had pretty good spellcraft. Yeah, our spellcraft is 19. How high a skill do you need in spellcraft? Thank you, Blue Diamond. Yes. And a random plus two armor. Yes. Mm. Well, nothing we can learn from him, I guess. And we have hellhounds that are very angry now. Okay. They weren't angry before. Bye bye, doggies. Bullets. We can actually use bullets for a change. Want and a spell breach scroll that might be useful. A visitor, a rare occurrence indeed <laughs> these days. It's a pit fiend. I can never figure these guys out. They're always plotting something. So, mortal, what can I do for you? What do you know about the master? A powerful, ruthless, unstoppable. He looks, uh, he looks human, but I suspect he is much, much more. That is all I can say about him. I guess I'll have to find out how unstoppable he really is. But first, I'll, you'll have to help me open the laboratory for me. Ah, a bold, a bold plot to strike at the master, is it? Bold, suicidal, but bold. I can help you in this your endeavor, but as I am sure you expected, I will require something from you first. My terms are not negotiable. Let me guess, you want me to work against one of the other fiends here? Not directly, no. This is a more personal matter. There is an imp who serves as my eyes and ears in this place. I've not heard from him for some time. I want you to locate him and see that he is able to return to me. Actually, I already found him in the side room. He's paralyzed from some bookshelf. A bookshelf, you say? How interesting. I wonder what he might have been doing there. That's all you had to say? We had a deal. A deal, mortal. What, that you would not lo only locate him, but enable him to return to me until this is done. I owe you nothing. Okay, so I have to find out how to get uh, that imp out of its weird trance thingy. So let's have, uh, maybe we can now have a talk with him. Let's see if we can do something about him. Yeah, the only odd thing is that book that we have. Uh... So I wonder if I can do something to get my spellcraft up a little bit. And that we can finally get enough spellcraft to uh, figure this out. Or if there's someone... No, I don't think... Uh, if I give it to someone else, would that count for the uh, spellcraft checks? Hmm. I'll have to look into that. We might as well give it a try, actually. Uh, so... 
I think Ali might have uh, the amount of law we need here. Just put everything on there and then let her activate it for herself. No, we don't even have the uh, chances, so... Or is it used? Okay. Guess this is just class. This is just... Uh, Lord check failed. Now I wish we had brought... I mean, that's got to be an insanely high Lord check, because if we look at our stats... Or it is still using our stats, I don't know. But I mean, if we look at Eleni's... We can't. Okay, so I'm guessing we're using my stats. Alright, let's just be ballsy and try it out. Zul of Elmran! What the fuck is happening? Everyone is just confused now. I hope this doesn't last too long. Okay, thankfully the imp seems to be uh, invulnerable. Now we just have to get these guys to stop fighting each other. There we go, okay. Okay, fine. Attempt number two. I'm listening. Guess we can just give I'm it to Denzin yes. since no one else can really use uh, the stuff. Okay, so Zulof Elmeran does not work. Athkaton Karoan! Your skin tingles briefly, but nothing else seems to happen when you utter that particular phrase. Okay. Tiro Utlon! That worked! Free! Thank you! Thank you for going away now! Let's not find all the secrets! Now I'm curious what the rest of the book does. Let's try it out. Probably gonna end up dying here. So we had the uh, teeth from Cobalt Alvas! Okay, that would do some mind affecting things, but I'm immune, so that's good. So that was probably not a good thing. Ferba! Ferba! Nekun! I've gone blind! Okay, well, that doesn't stop us from reading more of this book. Apparently. Maso of a yen! That just does a bunch of magical damage. Yaklot death! That also does a bunch that does a bunch of cold damage. Okay, so none of that is terribly useful. Wonder what happens if we give it to Zaxis. He's a great reader. Yeah, Zaxis just won't help me. He's a dick. Yes. I would say yes. Okay, I returned your imp to you, uh, big ass prick. My servant, have you found him? Yes, and I freed him. He read the wrong phrase in a book he found when he was imprisoned. Interesting. Will you show these phrases to me? Why would I do that? If it freed you, your imp, you could use it to free yourself. The circle which bind me is too complex for simple magic to undo. I am merely curious. No, I don't think so. Just hold up your end of the bargain. Very well. You have no idea just how much you've helped me. As we agreed, I will help you open the portal to the laboratory. Yeah, I don't know what the book does, but I don't want to give anything to a bloody pet fiend. And let's actually heal up first, because we are not uh, doing too well on the rest of the crew. Mm -hmm. 
Should I just cast two heal spells or do a mass heal spell? I think a mass might be a good idea first, at least. Ah, uh, we can do it without the confusion. And let's throw in one more mass uh, group heal spell. Yes. No, one more yes. mass group heal spell with... Uh, I think we can do it without true seeing. So that nearly heals up everyone there. Let's just... Okay, these two in. Good, let's move on. We are free uh, of the devil keys, as it were. Just need one. Without... Oh, hello, succubus. Why are you just attacking me? What an aggressive bunch of uh, young ladies. And here I thought uh, the pretty ones would be aligned with myself. Shows you that the beauty is just... Uh, there's nothing to cover up an ugly soul. Power of love! Uh, Eleni is charmed by this young lady. Snap out of it, Eleni! They're not cool! They can't even wear sunglasses. And even Casafir, Paladini is uh, charmed by these. That's a very, uh, that, 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 that should not be something you tell your paladin order. Demon blood, cool. Could we turn that into magical essences. Okay, Nishka snapped out of it. And Kazafir out of it. Okay. So you send your little bitches uh, at us there, blood in. Well done! Well, well, you've earned an audience with me. Watch out! This one's a succubus! They bore easily. And the thing that amuses them, well, we don't want to go there, trust me. Or at least I don't. Please speak. Mm, and do keep it interesting. If you were interested in talking, why did you have them attack me? They are father. I surround myself with them for amusement. But oh, how long for more... How I long for more masculine company. My, what a specimen you are. You may provide an interesting diversion. Don't even try to manipulate him, or you'll, you'll regret it, I promise you. Yes, Ellie's right. Your charms are wasted on me. I have the power of love, and I only love the beauty of the soul. I don't think she really knows us too well. Knows us too well, or else she wouldn't have never even have tried. Such spirit, a rare quality, but often lacking, especially considering your the inherent weakness of your species. Weakness, eh? I have mated with several of your kind, and none have survived the experience. Perhaps you su you would succeed where others um, others just made a mess. On the other hand, you'd probably end up disappointing me, just like all the rest. This conversation is beginning to bore me. Say something interesting, there's no, or there's no telling what I'll do. Let's throw the old Sunite charm. You are the one of the most beautiful women I've ever met. Ow! Okay. That's a shame. I didn't want to lose three uh, representation with Eleni. Can't you see I'm just lying? She's just alive. It pleases you. So be it. Such flattery. Hey, are you are you sure you're entirely mortal? You're as charming as a demon lord I once knew. You know, the silver tongue of yours could be useful in start restarting a sweet carnage Coroboros and I once shared. 
I have no idea why Korobor stopped attacking me. I would ask him uh, myself, but I'm trapped in this circle and his hounds kill my messages on sight. Uh, what do you want me to do? Why don't you see if Korobor, uh, see to Koroboros and convince him to send another pack of hounds against me? Okay, I'll do it. Of course you will. And in return, I will agree to help you uh, get into the laboratory you're so concerned about. I don't like this. Dealing with their kind always carries a price. I have no intention of letting her escape after this, trust me. Very well. As long as you we are on our guard. Hurry back! By the time you return, I will have gathered my servant in preparation for the coming carnage. Yeah, um, so the thing is, I don't want to lose three infants with uh, Elni because of that. I like uh, keeping that three uh, infants that we got. So I am actually going to try something different than Charm, but it should lead to the same result. So a little bit of a flashback for four thingy bidik, and then uh, yeah, we'll have this handled. All right, so this time let's not be uh, as diplomatic because jealousy flares because people can see through blatant charming and lies apparently. Let's perform a little tune. It probably won't work. Oh, I'm falling asleep. If you cannot infuse, you know, perhaps watching my servants tear you to shreds will. Come, my servants, entertain me. Wow, that was very easy. At least no influence lost. Let's continue. Ah yes, that is so exciting. Nearly is in front of when Corobor sent his hellhounds raiding. I have no idea why Corobor stopped attacking me. I would ask him myself, but I am trapped in this circle and his hounds kill my messengers on sight. Yeah, so let's uh, get that done. Okay, we'll do it. And obviously we have no intention of letting her escape. So yay, people like me more. That's important. So then we can get them to open up more to us and we have more involved relationships. Any Coroboros? Our business is done, mortal. What else do you think you can obtain from me? Blood and send me to, uh, to relay requests to you. What now? A feeble plot that does not does seek does she seek to say that well, does she seek to set in motion? Send your pets to attack Bloodin. What makes you think I would commit my forces in a raid against Bloodin with the threat of Saxus in the other corner? Succubi are weak. With my help, your hellhounds will win easily. Very well. I will provide... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> that voice somehow kind of uh, strains on the uh, vocal cords. Very well. I will provide you with a portion of my forces for this attack. Lead them to victory. Come forth, my pets. You will have succubi flesh to feed upon. Don't underestimate blood and she is torturous. Okay, cool. So we have big doggies. Now we just go over here and she will then send uh, her succubi to go and fight the doggies. Or she should. Blood and brought you a doggy. Oh, excellent! You brought me some entertainment. So, which side are you planning to fight on? I'll fight on my own side! Oh wait, that's not shit! Excellent choice, now time to have some fun. Oh well! Wow, okay, those are some scary doggies. You know what, while we're at it, since uh, 
Don't have to turn anyway. Let's bring Nishka back. There we go. Should have just picked my own side. That would be way better yes. fitting. And I need my regeneration ring back on. I tried to uh, do it to you know, with the knowledge rings. I still couldn't translate the book at all. So I'll just put these uh, rings back on. And give them back to. You. It's a gold ring. Let's put it here. All right, Bladen, did you have your fun? Now open a damn door. I am so glad to, to hear that I made you happy. I am not normally one to honor non-binding contracts or any contracts really, but since you have so entertained me, I'm feeling generous. You have my help this time. You're going to die, uh, die, die, you know, a pity. I won't be able to watch. And that seems to be, uh, yes, we've gone all round about and the portal is open, so we could go through. But I think we'll leave that for the next episode. So, till then, when the final big confrontation is afoot. Oh, hang on, I think I finally figured out one of the uh, phrases in the book. I think one of these uh, insane phrases is DE GUTEN AN ROL. Yeah, uh, something like that, apparently. Very, very weird and mystical. Anyways, till next episode, bye-bye.